Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Big Baby JTV, man. Let's start with a like. Put the comments up, bro. Road to 1K subscribers. We gonna make it, man. We gonna make it. We gonna make it. <laughs> Shouts out, Jada. But yeah, man. Let's get into it, bro. Nicki Minaj. Nicki. And Tucker Max versus Joy Reid, all right? If y'all been hiding under a rock, I'm just going to say it like it is, man. Nicki Minaj was on Twitter, right? And she said some few things about, you know, the the, the poke. We're going to call it the poke. Shout out to Coach Greg Adams, right? And how one of her cousin's friends, not her cousin directly, but her cousin's friend got the quote-unquote poke, Right? And it caused his testicles to, I'm saying, explode and be huge to the point where the man then became impotent. He was supposed to get married and his wife said, nah, we can't sing the marriage off your impotence, right? And later on, you know what I'm saying, on her tweet, she said, hey man, I do your own research. I'm probably going to take it, but, but I'm probably going to take it when I have to go to uh on, on tour right she even asked her audience which one was the best poke right so at the end of the day right everybody only cared about her treat about testicles bro that's how dumb our society is and you know what it makes sense if everybody else cared about it right you'd expect the journalists right to be the ones who would do some kind of research and see the nuance in her argument and at least bring a more neutral field nah not joy reed <laughs> not joy reed bro not joy reed of msnbc bro this is why people don't trust the media this is why people like philip defranco huge this is why abba and preacher huge this is why even stuff like mines i have a few subscribers but people trust me more than they trust the stupid media right because joy reed took nikki's words completely out of context and made her seem like a i'm saying anti-vax made her seem and look like somebody sending misinformation whether knowingly or unknowingly right when all she was doing was asking questions was asking questions and we are in a society right now where if you have any questions about the poke or any questions about the government then there's something wrong with you right we used to live in a society where we always questioned the government we always asked hey man what's up with this what's good with this right as some of y'all know canada is having an election this is an election year as weird as that sounds they called an election basically 20 days ago shouts out trudeau i'm saying that ironically right but what's happening now is that we're in a society where if you ask questions and you're a little critical of the government you taking your time and saying hey bro is this the right thing to do they look at you weird apparently they took away and suspended nikki's account <laughs> to the point where the only rational person who had even some kind of nuanced arguments was tucker max of all no not tucker max tucker carlson of all people bro what is up with that what is up with that in this society where Tucker Carlson is speaking common sense, bro? Right? And Nicki Minaj, a hip hop, you know, artist, right? The best female rapper alive. She's the one who's making common sense and asking more nuanced questions, bro. What society are we in? <laughs> I'm telling you, bro, these are the end times, bro. These are the end times. And these are signs of the times. I'm telling y'all right now, I'm a barb right and i stick with nikki on this bro ask questions have some suspicion bro understand that our society right is not meant to just lay down and follow everything that the government says right and it's weird that now y'all think it's weird for us to question the government and question their intentions right as if y'all don't know about the ronald reagan era and the 80s <laughs> as y'all didn't just see uh, America spent 20 years in Afghanistan for no reason, right? As if y'all didn't see George W. Bush say that there were uh, weapons of mass destructions in Iraq, right? As if y'all didn't just see 
Justin Trudeau acting like a fool all the time. And y'all are here trusting the government. Congratulations, you played yourself, man. Shouts out to Nikki. We're barbs on this side. She ain't about the poke. And we rock with her, bro. Respect to her, man. And Joy Reid, shameful, bro. Shameful. You're not a Twitter troll. You are a journalist. And try to have some kind of integrity instead of pushing your agenda upon the people. You feel me? Anyways, man, I'm out. I could preach more. Y'all go on my Patreon. I'm going to tell you why I'm not taking a poke and why you shouldn't either, bro. Big Baby JTV, and I'm out, bro. Like the video. We out.